Okay, guys, thanks for joining us here in the charts. You tuned into the Market Beast Edition. It is your fellow competitor speaking. Today, we'll be exploring a request. High Tide, Inc. H-I-T-I. -I. We're getting to the request as soon as we can. Thank you for your patience, you guys. Uh, we're going to see uh, pull up a very simple chart. I'm going to give you where I think the market is headed over the next 30 days. So stick around to the end. If you're new here, welcome. Consider hitting the subscribe button if you find any valuable information on the content. Loyal subscribers, welcome back. YouTube algorithm, of course, is promoting the channel due to your engagement. Appropriate thumbs and comments. Thank you. Let's see what we have. It's a really super simple chart. So let's go ahead and dive right into the charts here, shall we? All right. So today is March 10th, 2021, and the current price of HITIF, if I haven't gone over that, that's the ticker symbol, is going to be 55 cents. It's down approximately 0.7% for the day. Okay. All right. Super simple chart, guys. Here we are. These are the weekly candles. Yeah, that's it. Really simple, actually. Ladies and gentlemen, you're looking at it. Uh, it's kind of an inverted dome or like a cupature formation. Uh, this is an OTC market. We typically don't uh, show this, but uh, there's enough data here. So it started back in uh, February the 4th, 2019. It just kind of entered. It started within this pattern, right? And they just kind of did the, if you're looking at the screen, the uh, buyers and the sellers just kind of having at it. I'm going to consider all of this as consolidation before it actually broke above this level here, which is currently at about 39 cents. And the buyers just kind of make a break for a really nice breakout to the upside. And then, of course, they were met by the sellers at about 88 cents, pushing the price down. So the seller's obligation right now is to just break back below this uh, level here at about 39 cents. If they can't, if they if they fail and get in the price back below the 39 cent level, which acted as a previous level of resistance, you guys know we go over this every single day. OK, that was a previous level of resistance. If the sellers can't get back below that level, then, yeah, it's just all of this price activity that you're seeing right now is just in preparation to move the price higher. Maybe build some sort of bull flag falling wedge. I'm not sure just yet. I don't need more more price action in order to determine what's developing here in the market. But it's pretty obvious to me that, again, as long as the uh, 39 cent level doesn't compromise, it's just in preparation to make uh, new highs uh, and, and potentially even obliterate the all time highs, which again is at like 88 cents. So let's do a really quick measurement from the current level up to 88 cents just to kind of retest or obliterate the highs. It's about 60 percent to the upside. OK, so that's what I'm seeing that again, this is a short video video, pretty cut and dry. I guess let's do a really quick measurement on how how much time did it actually consolidate started back in uh, February the 4th, 2019. And we were just kind of measured over here to the speculative official breakout, which will be January the 25th, 2021. Just take our ruler here. See how much time it's been consolidating down here. And that's going to be 715 days. That's a sufficient amount of consolidating, I would say, for a reasonable breakout from the uh, resistance level here to the green line. Let's do a really quick measurement of that really fast. OK, so the buyers have gone. OK, so that's about 125 percent to the upside. So that's fair. So I'd say that give the price some time. I'd say over the next 30 days right now, it's just consolidating. Excuse me. There's probably some profit taking going on in this range here that it's been uh, developing. And uh, again, these are weekly candles. If I haven't mentioned that, um, it's just basically consolidating. I'd say there. Yeah. Again, there's some selling interest going on. And obviously the sellers, the sellers are trying to push this market down. So from February the 1st over to uh, present day, let's just see how much time it's been consolidating out of this uh, potential official breakout. It's about 35 days. So I'd say give the price another 30 days. We should see the next move. I'm going to speculatively say that the this market will likely get a retest of the previous level of resistance. Now, I could be wrong about hopefully I'm wrong about that for the bullish case, right? But that actually would be an interesting buy-in opportunity. I would look at it as that. If I haven't already mentioned it, guys, we're not paid to say this and we're not invested in this stock. Just a simple request. We're going over the technicals. And I'm, I'm sure that you've already done your fundamental research on this company before you are investing in this. Okay, don't listen to me. I just look at lines on a chart. So hopefully this was useful in conjunction with the information that you guys are going over. Uh, thank you for the request. Uh, hopefully you have what my intention. I think the mar market will likely retrace back to the previous level of resistance. But again, I could be wrong about that. So just uh, assess your risk tolerance and, um, of course, execute your strategies out there. Know how much you're going to risk. Know where you're going to take profits. Know where you're going to take a stop loss if the market goes against you. Let's cut it out here, guys. Thank you for your time. Leave an appropriate thumb just below the video there if you enjoyed the content. Also, if you're new before you go, we cover the alternative markets. If you're into Bitcoin and all coins, we cover that. So subscribe with us. Hit the bell. We'll send you that information when it is available. And I think we covered everything, guys. So hope you guys are doing well. Take care of yourselves. Protect your portfolio. Again, execute your strategies. We're going to talk soon. And bye for now.